All right, guys, Vlim here, back. We're gonna finish the game, Fort Solus. I'm an idiot and accidentally closed the game in between episodes, so whatever. But yeah, this is the start of chapter four, uh, which is the final chapter. Jessica, so let's do this. Where is he? Just stop this, please. You don't know what you're doing. I could say the same to you. I'm saving lives. That's what I do. Adam, Asim, how exactly did you save them? Trophy? Oh, I've let this go on long enough. Oh, that a trophy? <laughs> Visit all locations. Cool. Um, frame rates. Not great for a second there. Um,. Even all the way up here. Come on, Jess. Stop staring at bees. Time to go. Sure. Progress. It's a funny thing, really. You are so preoccupied with whether you could. You never stop to think if you should. What area is this? It's going to be okay. Focus and calm. Just like they taught me. Focus mind. Maybe it's better if she doesn't know. Compiling a new co Don't care. Oh, that one's Helen. Do I need to open this? See if it has on here. Mm. It doesn't look like it's here, whatever. I don't think we need it then. I think we needed that cell thing though. That's all I need. Agro bees. Not the bees. Yeah, 
as we need that for this. The Frontier Project? That was shut down years ago. What? I can't believe it. I think I am going to watch like videos on this game, though. Because I am interested in just seeing like what... He's like, uh, truth be told, obviously, like I don't, I haven't the found the, the narrative that interesting. So but also, like, to be fair, it. I haven't been like paying super, super close this? attention. Uh, For the entire himself. Time. So I'm like, oh, maybe I'm missing some like hidden depth here. We'll see. Out of the I kind of doubt it, jungle, but it seems. We'll see. <laughs> Where even am I? He can't be anywhere else. Oh, I guess, I guess not. Um, that's the airlock. Where do I want to go? Oh, I guess I am supposed to go to the airlock. Um, don't I have a thing? Can I do this this way then? I don't know. Oh, there's the elevator. All this? This is the reason they are here. No wonder such an old base is still operational. All this, such a beautiful sight, even up here. going to be all right. It's going to be okay. I love like the the guide is literally like only I don't know, what, four more sentences or so. <laughs> uh... So I'm assuming it's a lot of just story stuff coming up. Yeah. No. Oh no, what a shocker. Oh wait, I didn't even see okay, dude, I'm not see, like I just I'm not seeing the button prompts. Okay. Okay, cool. He's gone. Great. Um Fuck this. Fuck staying calm. 
Yeah, you would think you'd be like moving quicker in this situation. But I guess not. Are you okay? Do you have any idea what I have done? What this has taken from me? Look, I read Helen's work. You you can report this. Helen's work? You read Helen's work? What about my work? Yeah, what about his Let's work? Report this to everybody. You know what they did? What? They suspended me. What? Me. I can't believe it. They came for me. They came At my for facility, him. and they took everything. We can walk out of here, tell everyone what we know. These were my colleagues. They were my friends. Then my family. Do you know what it feels like? <laughs> to realize you're never going home again. We can. We all could. That's sweet. But your hand shaking? Yeah. That's the first sign. And after that, it's not good. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, it's gotta be this way, because you really look like good people. And trust me, I. I take no joy in any of this. No! No! Why are you funny flopping over like that? screen tearing there and I couldn't tell if that was like supposed to be there or not. Uh, okay. But there are points where this game does look like really incredible, but there's other points where this game looks fucking ridiculous.
But really, this game feels more like a tech demo, right? Than like a full game. Oh, wait, I didn't see the triangle there. I know this is hard. Being the martyr always is. But your partner... She understood that. You got a chance to do the right thing here, Jack. How will they remember us? Because the ones who saved them from certain death... ...or the ones... ...who allowed it to happen. They'll name schools after us. Erect statues in our honor. We will become immortalized. And your friend. Oh, this game not come out on the Xbox. Her? Shit, man. I can't even remember her name. Well, that seemed really yeah. fucking convenient. I'm not. I'm, I'm not. Target neutralized. Central, this is Alpha Team. Situation contained. Identify yourself. <laughs> Sir, are you able to respond? <laughs> The conflict between inner lives Born in the ocean Of nuclear water I will dry a tear There we go, what a masterpiece I will wash your feet Yeah, that, that was very mid Um, I'm, I'm, look, I'm reading, uh the plot summary right now to see if there's like anything more that I'm missing here like obviously I, I, I did miss like a lot of the background about Four Souls because they didn't fucking bother <laughs> uh, with the messages and stuff by the end of it
Oh, yeah. Growth accelerant appears to be causing plants at the base of the greenhouse to die at an alarming rate. Taylor discovers this is caused by growing plants and food in Martian soil, which also affects them with a virus that spreads to humans upon consumption. As crew members begin to exhibit symptoms of the virus, Taylor alerts the agency in charge of Solus Operation, who ignores his warnings and ultimately suspend him from his duties. Seeking to obtain the outbreak, contain the outbreak and prevent it from returning to Earth and cause a global pandemic, Taylor begins killing his colleagues one by one. There's alternate. There's an alternate ending and there's post credits. Alternate ending. Taylor catches up to Leary outside of in the storm. They mortally wound each other in the confrontation. Both die either from bleeding out or so. Wait, why is that a better ending? I guess it's not. I don't know. Whatever. Uh, post credit scene we'll probably see in a second, right? Um, But yeah, I mean, like, again, like, uh, this, this game's kind of mid. Like, I, I think it's, again, like, for a two and a half hour experience, I think it, like, there is intrigue that he had here in the sense that, like, like, I mean, I think, like, graphically, obviously, it's very strong. I mean, it, Chris, it does have, um, I sent you a package. Do not open it. Okay. Do not open it. Just take it to Tom. Don't tell anyone, but he'll know what to do. Oh, is it too late? There's, um... So it's spread to Earth? There's something I gotta do up here, but, um... Check the girls in for me, and, um... Give him a kiss. I love you, Chrissy. Yeah, that didn't work out. Um, yeah, I mean, again, um, just kind of whatever game. I, I think this is probably better than Expanse. I think there's like a, probably a little bit more depth to have there than the Expanse, realistically. Um, it's still not that good, though. I mean, I, I still think this is, like, a really, like, tedious gameplay experience. Um, to where, yeah, this is, like, not fun to play. Um, I'm trying to open my games from the year thing. Um, so yeah, I, I think it's better than The Expanse. I... Pfft, is it better than Forspoken? Probably not. Like, obviously there's more, like, there's more to Forspoken. Even though, and like, I straight up, I don't dislike Forspoken as much as most other people, so... I don't know, I, I think it's, I think Forspoken's better. But I, I think, like, there could be a debate there, but I'm like, eh. Uh, I mean, this game's like, whatever. Like, it's not, like, bad. Like, it's not, like, actually bad. It's just kind of dull. <laughs> and kind of, like, just very generic. Uh, while also being extremely short. Not having much gameplay to it. It's simply you just walking around exploring. Which, again, is fine. If, like, I felt like the the narrative was interesting, like, surrounding that. But I really didn't feel that. I, I felt like this was 
kind of just an overly generic like sci-fi like uh, uh like deserted space station sort of game it's again it's like it's essentially like callista protocol or like dead space if you take out the aspect of like if you take out like the gameplay of it essentially um i don't feel like it does anything entirely unique to really make it stand out and uh beyond that it's like really it's it's like the main appeal again the reason why i cared about this game to begin with is because i knew it was like a narrative based game with roger clark and troy baker and like okay that's cool um but there's not really much um depth to really be had here um not from what i see i'll probably watch like some sort of like review like i, I saw that there was like a 12 minute video uh on this game yeah here uh, a sci-fi a thriller with a complex moral theme so uh, i don't know maybe i'll watch that and see if that changes my mind but really as is i'm like yeah this is just kind of mid um so yeah i guess we'll end here um again like uh i'll probably play last of us i probably won't i don't know i don't know what i'm doing with those maybe i should make those public so again, I, I've been recording my like no return playthroughs, but um, but I haven't been making them public just because I'm like, I well really it's simply because like the first one I did, I I didn't make public, so I was like, well, what's the point of making the other ones? But maybe I should make them public. It's like why not? Um, but yeah, I'll play no return the daily run, and then uh. Yeah, I think next game I'm going to play is just Sont. Uh, I think that's where we're going. If not, then it'll be something like Goodbye Volcano High or Star Trek Resurgence. Probably one of those two. If I, I still need to make room on PlayStation. Um, but anyway, yeah, that's it for, uh, for Solus. Thank you for watching.